is Velma Apomao Maset. I am a medical laboratory technologist and I work in Kenyatta National Hospital. I was recommended to this program by my employer, which is still Kenyatta National Hospital. The key challenges uh, of uh, fertility in my country is that uh, most of the fertility centers in my country are private centers and therefore they are very expensive and not so, many ca uh, not so many people can get treated in this fertility center. Um, to my knowledge, uh, most of uh, the fertility centers are private centers which are not so many and uh, the fertility experts are also few. Uh, in embryologists uh, are very few too. The options for fertility care treatment uh, are uh, normally IUI, uh, XC, uh, ovarian stimulation, and uh, PGT screening, and so much more. To my knowledge, uh, in uh, the private centers, they offer IUI, uh, IVF, uh, XC, uh, PGT screening, and uh, also ovarian stimulation, and uh, so much more. To be honest, uh, as I came for this training program, uh, embryology was uh, totally new to me, but I have gained knowledge and skill for embryologies, which will help me uh, in uh, assisting the patients uh, who have uh, infertility problems and through assisting the patients it will also help me to assist my country. Uh, just like other African countries, uh, infertility is a hidden burden. Not so many people talk about this issue and uh, most of the time the woman is the one who bears the heavy burden and uh, most of them uh, end up being depressed and uh, they have psychological torture and some of them are physically abused. Uh, the level of awareness of uh, fertility treatment in my country is very low, but I believe uh, as we are starting to learn about this, it will grow higher. Also, the level of uh, awareness of male infertility is poor. Just like I said, this was entirely new. I was eager to learn about a lot of things and uh, I've enjoyed learning uh, embryology and it has become an interest to me and I am grateful uh, to this institution which is uh, Kastuba Medical College. Uh, I have learned a lot of things that are so new to me and I've really enjoyed learning these and some of them are um, IVF, uh, micro manipulation and also andrology which is the preparation of uh, the semen samples uh, and so much more. I would advise the new aspirants to have a positive, a positive attitude as they come and to be eager to learn uh, so that we are all able to help the patients back at home as one. Uh, just like uh, my colleague had said, we are planning to set up an IVF center back at our facility. And with the knowledge that, uh, and skills uh, that have gained through this program, uh, we'll be able to help uh, uh, my facility to set up the IVF center properly and it also it will also help the help, it will also help us to assist the patient and give them hope uh, for those who do not have children. I would wish to uh, extend my gratitude to Mark Foundation and Mark Foundation as a mother for giving me this opportunity to attend this training program. It has been a life-changing experience with so much to learn and um, I would like to appreciate uh, the team of this institution, Manipal Academy of Higher Education, uh, the Department of Embryology and Reproductive Sciences for their warm welcome, uh, their willingness to teach us and uh, their patience throughout this training program. Thank you so much. <laughs>